capture. But hello, everybody. Gamer CJ, this is my second part of my tips and tricks video for a level 63 warrior on one of my favorite idol games, Idolon, the Idol MMO. So, last time I got cut off, don't know why that happened. I think I minimized it. So basically what I was trying to say was that each task you do, you get these merits and you can select, you can get merits for pretty much anything. I'm only at world two right now, but essentially you get, let's just say you get one. So for instance, this is all filled up, you know, the Huma, Humo Goblin is essentially like that's a, um, that is a star, um, <clears throat> excuse me, that is a, a star talent. So yeah, here, this would be the Humo, Humo Goblin, Humo Goblin. So this is something you have and you essentially kill a monster and you get health back. I really like this, like basically, now let me explain how you get these star talents. So you can go here, so let me find a party, you join others, and this is a dungeon. Each, each world has a, a dungeon, and there is, let's just say there is a shop. Um, these guys are not, I cannot create a party yet, hold on. But yeah, essentially you go in here, you enter. And then you can defeat frogs and get ingredients and then get the, uh, get the, um, you know, get the grand frog and, but this is what I'm basically going to say. So this is a shop. This is the shop, um, credits or what you can use to buy items in the actual, um, dungeon, but then the flow bar this is what you can get this is essentially for non-dungeon stats essentially um why is this not working uh, this guy's a madge or is he Wait, i don't know what that means but essentially uh, i don't know what this guy is I don't know why this dungeon is not working. There's no happy hour, but okay, here we go. So basically with any dungeon, um, like for instance, the, the world bayonet, which is what I have. So basically, um, let me, let me do a little overview of the dungeon. I kill that. You get all those items. You can wait. The grand frog, which is essentially the boss of this dungeon. Um, now, some of the items I don't know if you can actually keep because when you earn credits, also it, this actually it doesn't actually raise your player level. This is more of just part of the dungeon, I guess, is what basically. But you increase health. Um, So you have full health, spores and legs and everything. Um, you can sell that and you can get you can get items. You can get RNG items, new weapons, new armor. Um, I also recommend going up here and trying to kill some of some of these enemies. Because if you clear if you clear part of the dungeon you get you get credit. See eventually I guess he will wake up. Depending on, oh, see, he's coming now, see? So, you kill him and you get credits. You get dungeon credits. Then collect more items, you get more dungeon credits. I always want to play with the actual, um, what's it called? 
it on, like the, um, what's it called? And some of the items you can actually keep. Can this guy hear me? Does he, does he know like I'm recording? But essentially with any sort of like dungeon, if you don't have the right level for it, um, you're not going to get the, um, you're not going to get the item, I guess. Like that stuff. Yeah, I, I essentially have this here. It usually will automatically collect. You can kill this to get dungeon credits. You essentially get all these like dungeon credits for like I obviously have auto on, but yeah, these guys are tough actually. They're really, really tough. Yeah, that's a silver one. I have that recipe unlocked, but I don't know if they're actually let you keep it. Well, you can use actually some of your attacks. You actually need more um, multi points or whatever they're called. I also recommend selling some stuff. To get done I love the dungeon credits depending on what like let's say you get something oh he's coming he's coming I gotta go grand fog is coming I mean let me kill the grand fog I always recommend actually picking those up do dungeons if you can once I discovered that there were dungeons in this game I was like Sweet. You get credits for this, and that's what I actually enjoy. I would actually use my, um, I would actually use, see these guys, these are like versions of frogs. See, that's damage that you hit, but if you're if you're you increase your level you know it's he has more damage in this thing but well, you obviously can increase that depending on what level you are in the dungeon oh, yeah yep so I got a, a card. No, also, I have a lot of slots. I recommend being aware of how much slots you have before I give anything like that is something I got. I'll let you know, I'll show you guys at the end of the, uh, at the end of like the dungeon, ta dungeon timer, but essentially you increase the, like your level on the dungeon. That's how you most likely increase your health. You see, I can get like an RNG item here. I mean, I would take that. Then you open, you destroy these, and it increases the the amount of like enemies that spawn in for any given time. Like I first thought, see those cards, I like those cards because those cards. And once I'm done with this, I'll explain cards. But cards essentially 
are here. Like these are part of the dungeon. Now, once I once I explain to you guys what cards do, um, I love collecting cards. Like this is an alternate. I mean, this is my one of my favorites because, like, when I essentially am playing the game, I have absolute blast. You know, I absolutely enjoy it. I really do. It's such a fun experience. He is a, um, I don't even know what level it is. He's a, see, it won't let me click. Usually you can like double click and see, but it won't let me. And then before I do that, I'll also check out, I'll also show you guys the different, um, um, <clears throat> excuse me, the different, um, they're called Coliseums, and you unlock them. See, I need more multi, I need more, um, see, that's, uh, um, I love these uh, RNG items. It's funny, I've actually not died in a while on this. Dude, come on, dude. Yeah, these levels essentially change. And after each level you get, you get these loot dice and that will determine how much how much you essentially earn throughout the um, match, essentially. Okay, so let me see what, what loot I get. So that's one, that's 12, that's skill, XP. Um, those are keys, and that's, that's that. So now that this is over, we can actually, I can actually leave. So now what I could do, oh, okay. Now I only have 48, what happened? I'm gonna really use the party now. I'm gonna leave the party. I don't wanna do it again. I'm gonna add another friend. He's trying to say, he said I did absolutely nothing, like what? I love how he said, like I did absolutely nothing, but I don't remember not doing absolutely nothing. But, so yeah, I don't have enough. Okay, you hold that down and then you can get like different key fragments. So unfortunately, according to him, I didn't do much, so. Now, this is the other thing, too. I recommend joining a guild, and you get, like, points for it. So, you defeat a couple numbers, like, like, like you get a chop, a fishing minigame score, you defeat, and then I guess you get, like, a bonus. Um...
and yeah, like you get, I'm pretty sure you get bonuses for that. Like you get these different, different bonuses for, for everything. Um, I mean, you get like AFK rerolls, you get like gifts and everything. That was a little weird because I thought I did stuff. So yeah, you, you get you can get like a talent boost, you get like monster cash. Uh, you can get like these rings and everything. Like I got that ring. Um, that one, that one I have, and I know I have this one too. I don't have that one yet, which is ironic because it, you know it's funny. I thought I did stuff. I guess I didn't. So yeah, so I recommend trying to increase your items you get, but unfortunately I don't see, I don't have enough for that. Like I did stuff, I guess, I guess I didn't. All right, so let me, Let me go back here. Oh, did I get anything? I didn't get any. Uh... All right. So it's a talent book. Um, you can essentially click on it. I don't know what. Okay, so that's that does not work for me. Unfortunately, that level is too high. I recommend if you don't like any items, I do recommend trying to sell it like I, I'm going to do. I sell that. I really don't need that. Now, the other thing I am going to uh, say too, try to do stuff that you're going to get like golden food because, for instance, that's going to increase your health and everything. All right, so let me, let me see. That is a pendant. Oh shoot, I need my ring. I need my ring back. So that's good for accuracy. Um, I'm gonna go back here. And then I'm gonna do one more thing. Before I, oh, I'm not done with the tutorial yet. I love how he said, I, did I really do nothing? Like I don't remember doing nothing. All right. So I'm pretty sure over here is, well, maybe it's the next world. Okay, no, no, that's the next world. So you go up here, um, and this is what's called a Colosseum. So this is essentially where you, um, get these tokens and you, this is a Colosseum. So I try to do that. So even though it says don't do that, I still recommend doing that. You wind up getting a lot of coins and I also recommend also, you might get a lot of bonus items too. So that number goes up. So essentially, depending on how far you are in the game, like for instance, for me, like I get a lot of damage and I get a lot of stats. So it's good to just play the dungeon and get like points. I'm pretty sure, like you can get, uh, I'm pretty sure guild points.
I also recommend if you if you do want to like AFK, I recommend like AFK at like an area that like like for instance, I'm just gonna do like right here. So for instance, for me, I'm trying to get my mining up, I'm trying to get my mining and chopping up. I recommend doing mining. The most score that I've actually gotten in this, I mean, it's been a, been a very big score. But yeah, I mean, this is basically just what... I think I have a lot of, a lot of stuff now. If you need, like, if, if you guys wouldn't need, if you guys don't need any of those items, I just recommend like just getting rid of them. I mean, I mostly am doing this mostly because I get a lot of coins. You now the other thing quickly, I will before we before I end this guy and this these tricks and kicks and tips and tricks is the um. And then I like to skip to the next round, like when I can, because essentially beating all these guys. Essentially, I'm doing a challenge right now. Uh, with, I don't know if you'll see it here. Um, this one. Um, I need like instant tab, like followers, which will be dropped by these rats. Um, I do get my skill up first. For a second. I'm running out of time. Alright. So I kill a lot of items. Um, enemy, excuse me, not items. I have a lot of items here, that's what I meant to say. So let me see. So let me see what I get out of there. I get coins, I got a golden which before I do that, let me actually add that to my food. That increases your damage dealt to monsters. That increases copper. And then increases food. And then one more thing I'm going to show. And then that will be for the guides for now. Oh yeah, and speaking of before I do that, I don't know if I explained this already, but... I'm so far off in the game at this point. There's nothing really I want to, like, I don't need for these items at the moment. So I usually will sell them because I essentially just need, um, I only need, like, essentially a few items. Um, 
for one of the items, actually, I do need... I don't need Dados right now. Pretty sure I don't need those right now. So if you don't need anything from the game, I recommend just selling it. Because I, I really don't need those. I, I also recommend like trying, if you did unlock stamps, to try to invest. Like This is what I'm trying to currently do right now. I need to get the right amount of logs, but I'm actually trying to increase my chopping level because in that way I can actually chop um, these veiny logs because I need a certain number of veiny logs and then, and then I unlock some items. So actually I think I have an unlock. Okay, no, I don't, not yet because essentially I need, I need it to just go to, I'm, Minimum 5%. It's going to take a long time. So, really quick, let me just see something. And then I'll go to this area called the arcade. But essentially, see, now I can like level that up. Now, Mania is essentially, this is really good for that. But the skills are basically the ones I'm trying to like level up. This one is is what I'm trying to level up. But the chopping is basically what I'm trying to do. Because I'm because I'm according to this, you can actually see it here. I'm only level twenty six in chopping. I'm only level twenty eight in mining. And then I'm but those are basically and then of course Fishing is a good one because I need to get these hermit cans because I'm actually trying to get a new fishing pole. Um, I love going back and forth. Like this is the one I'm trying to do. And then trying to also get a, a small thing of current hermit cans. And then actually before I do that, let me check. So essentially, um, you get, uh, let me see if I have enough now. Oh no, I need 300. So basically, I, tr I try to invest my, like I got that. I got the gold pickaxe. I got the mining. And I'm trying to actually get the, like this gold net. And I, so those are the two basic things for the moment. And I'm trying to invest in that because that's, that's like, adds a lot of damage. So yeah, essentially I am working on getting that. But I want to get the fishing done first before I do anything. All right. Um, I'm just going to check if I do have enough. In the meanwhile, oh yeah, speaking of which, any statues you get, I recommend uh, doing because, I mean, it's just effective. You know, that way you can increase your chopping power, um, chopping efficiency, because the efficiency, in my opinion, is the best. But the mining efficiency is good because mining can do a lot of stuff. You can unlock new mines um, and all that stuff. But yeah, I mean, essentially right now. Do I, do I even have enough? Hold on, hold on. Do I have, oh, I think, oh no, did I? Before I actually show you that, and I'm going to show you one more thing, but essentially with this, I do need a lot more. I am trying to increase that level, and I recommend also trying to do 
was the easiest. Oh, and one more thing too. Um, you get free companions um, with like each day. So yeah, you get these um, All right, you can buy it. I don't recommend buying it. And then you, and then you, essentially, what I'm going to do now is essentially leave. Some, I'm going to be really honest with you guys. Um, like some of these skills, for instance. Like I recommend, for instance, for me, I recommend getting so many skills done um, that that you probably would need in the future. So, for instance, because I really want, I really want more, more chopping power. Then I recommend trying to go AFK in that. Like for instance, for this, that's what I'm doing because doing, but I know like chopping power is going to be effective. And for, because I like upgrading these, I also recommend, because for that, you know, you need, um, you need, um, I need a lot of the, the oak. I need oak logs. So I'm going to go, probably grind when I'm done with this in in the oak log area. And then and then I need to get that done, but that's not really an issue right now. I also recommend doing stuff with like time candy. These, that's pretty, pretty good and basic. But, so this is what I plan on doing um, for a couple hours, just grinding to get that skill up. That. So that's also good too. All All right. All right. Now, before I do that, let's go. Great reference. Let's go to the arcade. I didn't get a lot of balls this time, but essentially, you get like. So basically, each bucket you get a portal, money, ball. Um, and this is what I got before. So essentially, um, you get you, I get a max claim of um, of two days and three hours. It goes up, honestly. It it does like that can go up. All right, back to this. That's it. Essentially, this is just a basic one right now. I get gold food. I don't know what a fragmentation is. And I get shop. So the shop, essentially, what this does, um, I don't know what Artifine is, but essentially, 
like I recommend, like I want, I'm going to upgrade the cat. Mobs are the enemies. Mob monsters. I don't know what the green is, but essentially I'm just upgrading that, upgrading that at the moment. I really don't have enough. So for instance, I get a lot of that. I get a lot of that. Um, yeah. Um, so yeah, essentially, um, this is my favorite sort of idol type game. Um, and also too, I recommend also to check in the anvil because there's like, for instance, there's a lot you could get, um, try to get your skill levels up because I, f and this is also a good one too. Um, smithing as well. I try to also increase that. You get XP for that. Um, just be on the lookout, especially for what, for, for, for what, but I always try to recommend like upgrading that because then you can like upgrade that, get more of that. But essentially, currently, like, really quick, and I'm going to do an overview really quick on fishing. Um, essentially, you pick, you you pick your, um, you, you pick your, like, bait and tackle that you want. Actually, there's a little shop here. You can, like, buy your bait and tackle. Um, you have, like, this one. Like, it essentially, I guess this is a stamp that you get. Um, I don't know what that does, but essentially you get, I guess, I guess that's for, well, this is a little shop over here. So I have this one, basically it's called non dynamite. This is dynamite. This is like, um, a ton of steel. I actually don't know what those do, but essentially for, for this, for this challenge, you need to get, um, so this is how essentially it works. You idle it. And for most stuff you do you can get um, a hermit can. That's the first hermit can. That's hermit can number one. You can get another hermit can, but for some reason, this is a little bit of a challenge. Even though I recommend doing it because you get a lot of stuff, like, like, um, it's not that difficult, but I like stamps. Because essentially, it's a good, it's a good thing that, that I try to. I would love to in, find a way where you can invest in like shipping and like fishing. But I also recommend because there is a shop here. I try to recommend in getting different stamps. So, for instance, like you need what? You need uh, four gold stamps. You need uh, like all that stuff. Cow prod. Um, but I recommend, like, I guess that increases your luck for stuff. So I do recommend, like, grounding for monsters and everything. Like, now I do have that, like, I don't know what the feathers are. But fish paste, that's a, to oh, shoot, that's a token, not a, a talent S stamp. I have no idea what that is. But I do recommend. So anyway, that's, like, with fishing. So I, each world has basic stuff. So I'm just going to put that there. Um, let me see what gold food. And there we go. So that's a good one. So this golden food increases my health. The golden namwich increases that as well. So let me go down. So each... Um, each, um, each part of the world has a, so also too, let me look this up too. So certain worlds or certain, excuse me, certain sections, you can get a, um, certain number of gold. So honestly, I really don't know how to do that. 
Um, like there are a lot of ones that I've actually not completed at the moment. Um, like this pig, you can't like I. I try to okay. So the next one then the next the next one has the um. Oh, and then I'm going to show you the boss really quick, and then I will actually uh, end this uh, quick tips and tricks. So I always recommend if you guys want money, I recommend trying to get a, uh, like, look around and, like, see what you want, for instance. So, like, go up here, for instance, like, um, and there are also certain shops you can get. So this guy's a shop, right? That's not golden food. That's not golden food. I got a heart stamp here. And then obviously, so there's really nothing here I want. Um, you have basic food items here. Um, for instance, like, so before we like really, uh, I already did that. <laughs> I have to do it again. <sighs> party crest. Like, see, the party crest station, that doesn't really mean anything to me like that one that i did like i don't know what that essentially does so i'm not doing it but and then i'm gonna show you the boss and i'll be done this is a little bit of a long video it's dragging out a little bit so with these boss tokens essentially you um So you go here, you can enter this. You can usually say the accuracy level. So I'm just gonna do normal. So Emrock is the um, boss of this, boss of the world. Now I can actually beat him pretty quickly. Um, he's not actually that difficult to defeat once you get on a high level. Essentially I can beat him pretty fast. And um, essentially for this, like, I mean, I can beat him. Like, my damage is pretty high on him. You know, I beat him. I get, I don't need the quest item anymore, actually. I get a silver uh, stopwatch. I get some silver stopwatches. And I essentially get all those. Give up on life pants. I don't need the desert trope because I already completed that. Um, I have two statues, non-witches. I don't have any golden food. Now, the power statue is really good. Like, I recommend trying to save statues because it's really good in this game. Like like I said, that's the, the boost. But essentially, there's, like, no, like, there's no easy access because in the codex, you get, like, easy access. So that increases your base damage, and then this cre increases your base health. And I always, I mean, I want to find a way, like, you could do that now. Because my other character, actually, like, I don't know if I, I need another one. So I'm just going to put that there. Um, I need that um, for crafting some items. I need that. I need that for a quest. And I don't need that. Um, so, yeah, I mean, essentially, now, some of these... I do need, like, just progress the story. Like, the bandit, the bandit Bob is good, but this one is really good. You, you get that one. This one, like, I'm not interested in that. That one I'm interested in. I think I actually have that one. And then this one, I'm really not in the, in the mood for. But because it, like, I guess it just increases, like, this is really good. These are really good. But essentially, just find ones that are going to increase your accuracy and be able to increase your damage. Because if, if you find a way, like, you can, like, that, for instance, like, I need need that, but I'm not really going to do that at the moment. Um, so, you know, I have enough to increase my MP, like, critical damage, you know, doing that. Um, like increase your total damage, increase your base XP, increase your strength. Um, like anything that you guys could essentially, like you, like 
it's 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 going to be like different for everybody but essentially if you you know whatever floats your boat in that sense is would be good for you essentially um like i said i need to increase my fishing um bugs are good critters because that like i said it, it changes each level um essentially now what i'm gonna do is i'm going to um do that just so i can get more more mining power and also to increase the chopping affection effective effectivity effectivity of the chopping um and i recommend like staying for it for a couple hours because then i obviously check this game like every night some nights i don't really check it at all because i feel like i don't need to and look also too like like for instance um i know i'm going on in circles but essentially what i'm trying to say is um okay in order to upgrade that or let's say i want to upgrade that oh i have enough so then i'll do that i have enough now let's go back up there i can increase the the arcade ball I, oh no i don't have enough yet Ooh, okay i thought i had enough but i don't let me see let me go back here Th this game is so easy and it's been like really addictive from like i've been very addicted to it lately but i've actually never been able to make a video about it because like it's not it's not some i don't feel like my essential like essentially my audience wouldn't like it because they would go oh what's this this isn't bowling this isn't pac-man now i just gotta say i'm sorry but this is what i want to record okay so increase that level and i actually essentially don't have enough i also recommend if you guys do have enough like pay attention to this because you can actually increase your levels you actually increase your ore level and everything. Um, all right. So when I go here to the oak logs, I also recommend doing it. Uh, when you do do it, try and clear your items. Because if you're going to be gone for a long time, I mean, you, you might as well just if like you need anything like for instance for this like i'm just going to clear it and just save it for the oak oak logs and then i'm going to go here oh and one more thing so up here there is this i guess there's this owl that you can do and these these essentially increase your um Why do I, I keep resetting? Why do I keep resetting? <sighs> Sorry, why do I keep resetting? Essentially, I just keep resetting this. Basically, this is located on this part of the map. Not a lot of people know about it. But this will increase the flowers generated. So yeah, this will increase all like the XP and everything of, of the game. You know, all these like will, will increase.
I don't know, it's just a random AFK thing that I'm doing. Yeah, my grandma's just doing a rosary. Yeah, I'm off today actually from Green Vision today, so my other you know, this this video's going on for too long. Watch, I put all this effort into it and everyone's like, why is it bowling? This is actually planned for Wednesday. I just feel like uh, recording it now. Yeah, this is just too long, and I also got to take care of my dog and all of it, too, so. Yeah, I mean, this just, you would just increase your, your level of uh, a flower of feathers, and uh, I enjoy it. It's actually pretty good. I enjoy it. So yeah, I and mean, you gain like boosts outside of the map, and I like I think it's like really good. I keep forgetting about that, but like this is really good for for I guess just increasing bonuses in general. Yeah, but you just increase like the increase like the flowers and everything and it's really good. I was doing it one more time and then Yeah, so essentially this is just another way to increase like different bonuses in the game. Uh, so yeah, I mean, that's just another area. He's not really the ex uh, one that you would know. And also too, there's another one up here. I don't know if I can like, okay, I keep missing him. Keep missing these guys, but essentially you get like different consolations and everything, and that will increase your effectiveness in in a certain area. Yeah, and then star signs. So essentially, it went over pretty much everything that I felt like I needed to go over for the most part. All right. Well, I guess. Um, 
That's it. Now let me go back here. And I'm going to go back to grinding this. Do I have any items? No, I don't have any items. And also, when you do get this, so let me sell this really quick. That's what I will own at, like, how many times I'm offline. And let me show cards off really quick one more time. Let me show this. So each card, you get different bonuses. So you get, um, you get different, like, cards and everything and all that good stuff. I think I get a mushroom card. Hold on. That's probably what I'm missing. So essentially, each each enemy is is going to drop a card, and and you can actually uh, essentially <clears throat> equip a card to your to your loadout, essentially. So yeah. So for instance, for let's say that for these card bonuses, you get like different stuff and everything. These are two different loadouts that I got. That one is what I got because I, I like the um, bonuses you get. Um, but then this is the other one you have. Um, I'm trying to like unlock different different bonuses here. Um, that one. But then these are the ones. And then you can actually use with your gems to get a new uh, card card bonus all right well that was a long that was a long video i hope you guys enjoyed it um i know i did one of my favorite idol games of all time uh in the current moment idol on i hope you guys enjoyed this one have a good rest of your week